India has broken out into celebrations after Neeraj Chopra became the first Indian to win a historic Olympic gold medal in athletics at the Tokyo 2020 Olympics. The 2018 Commonwealth Games champion, 23, registered a best throw of 87.58 m on Saturday. The Czech Republic's Jakub Vatlej won silver with 86.67 m, while compatriot Vytaslav Veseli took bronze. It feels unbelievable said Chopra. It's a proud moment for me and my country. He is only the second Indian to win an individual gold after a of Vendra in the 10-meter air rifle event at Beijing 2008. Prime Minister Narendra Modi congratulated Chopra on Twitter, saying that history had been created. Chopra's gold was India's seventh medal, one gold, two silver, and four bronze, in Tokyo, their best ever Olympic hall having passed the six they won at London 2012. It has been a good week for the country at the Olympics. On Saturday, wrestler Bajrang Punia added to the medal hall by defeating Kazakhstan's Talat Nyazmakov, 8-0 in their bronze medal bout. On Wednesday, Indian wrestler Ravi Gaya won an Olympic silver medal after he lost to Zavar Yugwev of the Russian Olympic Committee in the men's freestyle 57 kg final. The 23-year-old wrestler beat Sandy Avnurislam of Kazakhstan in a dramatic semi-final that saw him overcome a 9-2 lead with two minutes to spare, achieving victory by fall. In wrestling, if a wrestler touches the opponent's shoulder to the mat, then the victory is considered as a win by Paul. On Thursday, India ended a 41-year men's hockey medal drought when it beat Germany in a thrilling match to win bronze. Weightlifting champion Mirabai Chanda won India's first medal in Tokyo, a silver, in the women's 49 kilograms category, putting to rest the disappointment of the Rio Olympics in 2016 where she was knocked out after a freak injury. India's ace shuttler PV Sindhu won bronze after beating China's Hebang Jiao, becoming the first Indian woman to win two individual Olympic medals. She won her first Olympic medal, a silver, at the 2016 Rio Olympics. The women's hockey team created history by beating Australia 1-0. The team went through to the Olympic semi-finals for the first time in history after the Ronnie Ron Paul led side took the lead in the 22nd minute and defended it fiercely but the team were defeated by Argentina. On Friday, they missed out on a bronze medal when they lost to Great Britain in an Ipan Tuck battle. Nonetheless, they made history. Previously, India's best result was a fourth-place finish at the 1980 Olympics. Boxer Lavlina Dorgohain had assured India of another medal, a bronze after she beat Shen Yan Jin of Chinese Taipei to enter the semi-finals. In boxing, there is no third-place match, both semi-finalists are awarded bronze medals. Norgo Hain won that bronze when she lost to Busna Sermenali of Turkey, 5-0. Her bronze makes her the third Indian boxer to win an Olympic medal. The big misses for India's Olympic hopes. Wrestling. Vinesh Bogut's chance at Olympic gold ended on Thursday with a shocking 9-2 defeat to Vanessa Kalidzinskia of Belarus in the women's 53 kg quarter-final. The 26-year-old will return from the Tokyo Olympics without a medal after she missed out on the repechage round, the rule that allows athletes who failed to reach qualifications by a small margin to continue to the next round. In wrestling it allows wrestlers to get a shot at a third-place match, the idea being that a worthy competitor not lose out just because they got a tough early draw. Shooting India's 15-member shooting contingent was the favorite to bring back a big haul of medals but that did not go according to the plan. Manu Baker and Saurabh Chaudhary, favorites for a podium finish in the mixed 10-meter air pistol event, crashed out in the second qualification stage in Tokyo. Baker, pegged as a certain medal prospect even before the game started, failed to reach the finals in any of her three events. She had a pistol malfunction in the 10M women's air pistol event, leading to more pressure as she lost time. In the men's 10-meter air pistol event Saurabh Chaudhary, world number two and youth Olympic champion, qualified for the final but failed to finish in the top three positions. India has won a total of 28 medals since 1900, 11 from hockey, 5 from wrestling, 4 from shooting, 2 each in badminton, boxing, and athletics, and 1 each in tennis and weightlifting. Boxing Despite losing out on a second Olympic medal, Mary Kam is a winner for many Indians. She made a heartbreaking exit from the Olympics after losing to Ingrid Victoria Valencia of Colombia in her flyweight section bout. She initially thought she had won and was shocked to later learn from social media that she had indeed lost the match. 
losing on a 3-2 split decision verdict despite winning two of the three rounds left the boxer confused. She won a bronze at the 2012 London Olympics. Archery Deepika Kumari, the world number one in the women's recurve category, crashed out of the quarterfinals in Tokyo, losing to Korean and San in straight sets. This was her third Olympic outing for India, having lost in the quarters in Rio in 2016, and in London in 2012. Her husband, Gotnu Das, also crashed out of the Olympics after losing to home favorite Takaharu Furikawat, an individual silver medalist at the 2012 Olympics, in a pre-quarter final clash. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.